It's Barbie! <gasps> it's a dream house! This is the coolest dream house I've ever seen. A real life version of the Barbie dream house was created in Malibu and three lucky people can stay in it for just $60 a night. Hey guys, it's Renee Ariel here. And Fiona Zaring, and we're talking about the 60th anniversary of Barbie and the real life dream house they created in Malibu. It's insane. Honestly, if you had Barbies as a kid, even if you didn't, this is like everyone's dream come true. First of all, I not only had Barbies, I had a Barbie land set up in my room. I like created a whole corner. This was my actual childhood dream. Oh yeah, I had multiple Barbie computer games and I had Barbie Genie that came with a genie lamp that you'd like press buttons on. How did I not have a Barbie Genie? I thought I was on it. So basically circling back to the actual house, it's an Airbnb partnership, I guess. So you can actually stay in it and it's only $60 a night, but you can only stay in it for two nights and only three people in the entire world get to do this. So basically on October 23rd, it's going to go live, if you will, at 11 a.m. And then I guess whoever gets the first pick, like whoever clicks it first or messages the Airbnb owner, I, think I don't you, know. You like attempt to put through a booking request. Yeah, and then I guess they pick and then that lucky person gets to bring two of their friends and have the dream vacation we've all always wanted. Yeah. Well, there are a lot of amenities. There's an infinity pool with a slide, but like not just any slide. You know, in like the dream houses that we play with, it's literally the pink slide that like comes out of the side of the house and like swoops around to the pool. We have so to go. I know. <laughs> and then the kitchen is fully stocked, obviously. There's a meditation terrace. And the closet is full of like the most iconic Barbie looks. So like the fencing look, the astronaut look, all of those things, which I think the story is you like get to actually try them on yourself. Imagine the Instagram photos. That's not all. You can actually get a fencing lesson, I guess, with like a world-class fencing champion. I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> I didn't know that was something I was allowed to do. And there's like the iconic Barbie like pilot. Do you remember that one? Yes. So they're bringing in an aerospace engineer named Jill Myers and she's gonna take people on a behind the scenes tour of the Columbia Memorial Space Center. This is a whole Barbie field trip. Oh yeah. And if you hate cooking like I do, have no fear because they're hiring a chef. Chef Gina Clark Helm is going to be cooking you farm fresh food. Yeah. So you don't even have to do anything. You just sit there and then they make you food. My big thing that I did with Barbies when I was a kid is I gave them makeovers. Like oh I would no. Like, you like fix their hair and you do the whole thing. What do you, what, did you ever cut their hair? I did that too. It, it doesn't work the way Sometimes hard Sometimes I would like play fashion stylist. I would like mm -hmm. cut up their clothes and do all sorts of stuff. Not, not the collector's ones, obviously. Those are in the box. But it's sort of like you get to become a Barbie and get your own makeover. Not with anyone, with Jen Atkin, like Kardashian's hairstylist, Chris Teigen's hairstylist. Whoever these lucky people are, are getting the experience of a lifetime. You really are getting treated like a Barbie doll. Yeah, like, like between getting dressed, getting fed, getting taken everywhere, learning how to fence, because that's a thing I learned that you can do Barbie today. Yeah. Okay, so let's take a look at the outside of the Barbie house. As you can see, there's a lot of pink, which makes total sense since it is Barbie. There's the pool, there's the slide. See, they nailed the slide. There's honestly, more lounge chairs than we get for guests. But yeah, more lounge chairs than people are but to stay there. Maybe we could be friends whoever gets this trip, and then we could have those extra two chairs. We volunteered. <laughs> Please take us. Oh, look at how it lights up at night. You know what that means? Barbie parties. <laughs> Maybe a Barbie costume party. Everyone dressed up as like Barbie, Teresa. I don't remember any of the other Barbie <laughs> names. That would be awesome. Yeah. But I love how everything is look totally at the little, themed. Like the little lifeguard chair. It's so it's cute. So cute. Oh my gosh, so this is the meditation patio. Holy smoke. I don't meditate, but I would meditate there. And then the bedroom. Don't you just wanna sleep in that bedroom? You wake up and you feel like you're in a dollhouse. All of like the Barbie stuff, I feel like when we were growing up, this was the color palette. Like oh, Barbie yeah. always had these colors. I feel like if you didn't grow up like obsessed with Barbies, maybe this isn't as cool, but like you know all of those iconic Barbies. Yeah, and while you're getting your fencing lesson, you can put on the famous fencing outfit. You can do a workout maybe on the meditation deck in the blue iconic workout outfit. So wait, but they like 100% you, you think won't have signs saying do not put on 
Barbie gear? I don't think so. The way it made it seem was that you really just got to live in this Barbie mansion and live out your Barbie dream. That would make sense to me if it really was like a one-time deal. Only three people get to experience that because how many people are gonna try on yeah, this Yeah, it's outfit? not like it's unsanitary. Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to go in the kitchen and not cook in it and <laughs> just sit there. <laughs> Why don't I have pink bar stools? I know, honestly, this is giving me a lot of decor ideas. Right? Oh my God, they even have like workout equipment. Oh my gosh, not complete without a home theater. Seriously, I feel like this house has everything you could have possibly thought of mm -hmm. for a Barbie themed dream house. It has the perfect pool, movie, home theater, we have a beautiful kitchen where you don't even have to cook in it and that's like the worst part of kitchens is you actually have to do something in it. Oh my gosh, okay, well all right you guys, that's all the amazing Barbie news we have to share with you. Let us know down in the comments if you were a Barbie fan growing up or if you just think this is like whatever, a lot of pink, not your thing. And if you're gonna try and book the house when you're done with all that, be sure to click somewhere for another new video and don't forget to subscribe. As always, I'm Fiona Zaring. And I'm Renee Ariel. And we'll see you guys next time.